Well, a local store owner is defending his decision to stand his ground and open fire on a robbery suspect. The armed man walked into his store with a bag over his hand and demanded money. And that's all the owner needed to see. Action News' Kristen Sell is live on the west side. And Kristen, this is one of seven attempted robberies all around town in just a 30-hour span. And guys, I just spoke with the store owner. He tells me he's owned this gas station and this shop since 2000. And this isn't the first time an armed intruder has entered demanding money. That's all he wanted to say. He did not want to talk on camera tonight because this is an ongoing investigation. It's a corner store with a constant flow of customers. Inside, I counted at least nine surveillance cameras keeping silent watch. But this wasn't enough to stop an armed robber who police say jumped this counter and demanded cash. I got grandkids right here around the corner. They're shooting right here on the streets. I mean, it's, it's, it's stupid. David Painter tells me he's been shopping at Holiday Grocery every day for years. Police say this shop's owner pulled a gun of his own, shooting the robber in the chest. Painter bad, says anyway. the owner had every yeah, reason to protect like what's around. his. We're all trying to make it, you know, and then for somebody just to come in and take it from us after we work as hard as we, we do and as, as long as we have to have what we got, I'm not letting nobody take mine. I'll shoot him in a heartbeat. This is just one of seven weekend robberies around town. Police aren't sure if they're all related. Painter tells me it's the reason he got his concealed weapons permit. You need to tote your pistol with you on you at all times because they're not scared and they will come up and they're, they're, they're not scared to hurt your family or anybody with you. And the store was open business as usual today. Police continue to put all of these pieces of recent robberies together to figure out if they are connected. We're live on the West Side tonight. Kristen Sell, CBS 47 Action News. The robbery spree in Jacksonville began Saturday night. The Jacksonville Sheriff's Office just released these surveillance pictures of a man who robbed the Wendy's in Bay Meadows. Police say the robber walked into the kitchen and demanded money from the workers. He fired at least one shot, but fortunately, no one was hit. And here's a look at where all the robberies happened over the weekend. Take a look. Police are trying to figure out whether any of them are connected. If you have any information that can help lead to an arrest, call Crime Stoppers. It's that number on your screen, 1-866-845-TIPS. Remember, you could get a cash reward.